Richard Rawlings and his crew at Gas Monkey Garage have all spread their wings since Fast and Loud went off the air from Discovery. Let's start with the star. Gas Monkey owner Richard Rawlings ran a successful 16 seasons turning junk into rolling art. He walked away in 2020, announcing it on Joe Rogan's podcast. Fast and Loud is no more. <gasps> Now, in 2023, Richard Rawlings may have quit television, but he's still going strong with his business at the Gas Monkey Garage. Rawlings is off air because he is not involved with any traditional media company. Being active on all social media platforms is the name of Richard's 2023 game. His YouTube channel, Richard Rawlings and Gas Monkey Garage, documents the Texas-based garage's daily workings. Rawlings has much more creative control and freedom, which he always wanted. He recently sold a big chunk of his car collection in a massive auction in partnership with Bring a Trailer. He plans to use the money earned from his huge sale to invest in better cars with more pedigree, trading it all for a little more. The American Dream. Aaron Kaufman, aka The Bearded Wonder, was one of the founding members of Gas Monkey Garage and remained on the show for a long, long time. However, he left GMG in 2017, citing personal reasons. Since, Kaufman opened his resto mod shop in Dallas, Texas, named Arclight Fab. Their specialization? Restoring Ford F100 pickups. He's had solo stints on Discovery, shifting gears with Aaron Kaufman, and Aaron Needs a Job. They're both finito now, and his next project incorporates Route 66 in some way. He's also been racing, doing Pikes Peak, Stadium Super Trucks, and has been making bank as a brand ambassador for Magnaflow. His current net worth, $8 million. Yulan Heizo Martin, aka Sue Martin, the upholstery queen, runs her upholstery shop, ASM Auto Upholstery, and would appear sometimes on Gas Monkey Garage as an outside contractor. She was remembered and appreciated for her wit. Sue was missing from the show's last few seasons, and neither Rawlings nor Martin commented on her disappearance. Fans will be happy to know that ASM Auto Upholstery is still running strong in Dallas, Texas, though. Where is Christy Brimberry, the Gas Monkey Garage's office manager? Her husband used to be Rawlings' hairstylist, by the way. Besides being excellent at her job ordering parts and making sure everyone's paid, Brimberry also fought a very personal battle with cancer. In 2016, she had surgery to remove the cancerous lymph nodes from her thyroid gland. Brimberry still had to undergo further treatment in the form of radiation therapy. In 2007, she revealed to her fans through social media that she had won her fight against cancer. She left Gas Monkey Garage, currently enjoys her family family's company, works at her salon, and has an on-again, off-again OnlyFans site. What happened to painter and fabricator extraordinaire Casey Matthew from Gas Monkey? Well, Matthew was part of the Fast and Loud show until 2015. Then he forayed out to start his own venture, Casey Paint Shop, high-end restorations, custom hot rod builds, performance upgrades, all the good stuff. Remember Mike Coy? The former Gas Monkey paint and body guy? Well, he's also quite the Instagram sensation with over 226,000 followers. After a TV hiatus, Mike Coy is back as the shop boss and painter in the Netflix show Tex-Mex Motors, which films in El Paso. Hey, thanks for listening. See you next time.